Hello and welcome once again to Binary News for yet more of your daily focused gaming news and myself, Amata. Today is still the 15th of August and this time I have some news for you regarding Bloodborne. As according to From Software, the PS4 exclusive has been designed to feel less punishing than Demon Souls and Dark Souls. Now, Masaki Yamagawa, who served as the director of the Two Souls games and is acting as the producer for Bloodborne, said during the Gamescom presentation, quote, you died a lot in the previous games and you had to persevere. One of our main goals with this game is that sense of punishment. We don't really want to focus on punishing the player. We want to deliver a game that gamers love, so if the gamer likes the game, they will definitely like it enough to have that bit of perseverance. But in the way which we're making the game, the sense of punishment is much less. And they'll be introducing a mechanic by the name of the regain system. And after you take damage, you'll have a small window of opportunity to get some health back by successfully attacking back. And this should, Yamagawa said, quote, draw the user into the perilous combat we want to deliver. And then he said that he is hoping to remain true to the existing fan base while simultaneously attracting a wider audience, saying, quote, in terms of who the game is aimed at and who we want to capture in terms of the audience, of course we can't betray or disappoint the fans out there. They'll be the main ambassadors of the game. But we want more people to share in this experience. So one of the things we can't talk about right now, but we feel the new online concept and experience we've got for this game. We hope that we will capture a wider audience. So that might be slightly disappointing for some of you who perhaps wanted the pure punishing combat but harsh but fair that was very much present in Dark Souls and of course Demon Souls as well. But to be honest I wouldn't be too disappointed because while it sounds like they're maybe dialing it back a little bit it still sounds like it's going to have the f firm harsh but fair gameplay and the, this mechanic of basically encouraging you to put yourself in danger in order to get some health back will kind of add to that as well. Now, whether or not it's as difficult as the others, well, we kind of have to wait for the game actually to come out to sound, to actually figure that out. But it sounds like they may be dialing it back a small smidge, but I still think they're going to maintain the core concept of the Dark Souls and Demon Souls games. As they said, they don't want to annoy the existing fan base, but they simultaneously want to get more users, so they're dialing it back a little bit, trying to entice new people into the game and getting them to fall in love with the game before smacking them with the punishment that maybe isn't quite so unforgiving. Do let me know your thoughts, though, guys, and I'll see you next time.